Hey, you're right, guys. Trish from Winter's Joe here, and today we are watching and reacting to episode 23 of Friends Season 7. This is, of course, a two parter, and I'm assuming it's going to be all about getting ready for the big wedding, and then part two is going to be about the actual wedding. So, yeah, I'll see how I feel when I kind of finish the first part if I do part two back to back, but I, I think I've done a couple, but like two two parters back to back, and then like a couple two parters not back to back. So, it just depends how I feel. And yeah, I enjoyed the last episode. We obviously met Chandler's dad. I'm glad Monica kind of got him to go see him in Vegas. I think it was Vegas. So that, that's, I'm assuming Chandler's dad's going to be at the wedding now. We're going to have like a whole cast of characters there. Because we're going to have like Monica's parents as well. Like Jack's going to make a grand return, which is great. Maybe Janice will show up. One can hope. We shall see. So episode 23, guys. If you enjoy, remember to leave a like if you're new. Remember to subscribe. And if you do want the early and uncle reactions to friends, then link to the Patreon page will be in the description. And one of the comments down below where there will be quite a few episodes into season 8 by the time this one's on YouTube. A lot of people saying this season 8 is their favourite season. So I'm actually kind of excited to see what that season's all about. So uh, yeah, Twitter and Instagram will be down below as well. And we have just created a TikTok as well. I know, so <laughs> uh, bit the bullet and we're doing it. So uh, you can follow the link down below or just type in Trophy Muncher Clips and that should come up. Uh, but yeah, we've got friend I've, I've uploaded like two clips now and they're both of Phoebe. So it might be a little bit biased towards Phoebe, but that's fine. That's not a problem at all. So uh, yeah, anyway, <laughs> let's do this. This is probably the last time we're all going to be here in the coffee house as six single people. What? What's happening to the coffee house? But you're not really single, though, Monica. The old ball and chain. <laughs> old? Nice. The young, hot ball and chain. <laughs> Much better. Oh, you're still taking that? Okay, fine. The wedding dress, then we're going to have lunch with Mom. Ah. Joey, you're, you're having lunch with my mom? No, I, I just heard lunch. What? <laughs> yeah, I can oh. go. Sure. <laughs> oh, is that she joining him? He just invited himself. Cause her any unhappiness of any kind. Mm. I will hunt you down <laughs> and kick your ass. I mean, okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> a fair response. Okay, dude, <clears throat> stop it, okay? I'm, I'm not kidding here. Hey, I hear what you're saying. Season five, Ross, I'd be pretty scared of, but. Friends again? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> you won't believe what Monica's older brother just said to me. They <laughs> <laughs> got to leave. Uh, Ross trying to be, I don't know what, but <laughs> he's trying to be protective brother mode. Just not very good at it. I'm making a list of all the things that are most likely to go wrong at the wedding. That's a good mindset to have. Uh, my bridesmaid's dresses won't get picked up. He says someone's name at the altar. Probably go with that one. You got Remember that audition I had a while ago and I didn't get the part? The commercial? Uh, no. That play? No. That other play? No. Uh, yeah, the yeah. Movie? Wait. Yes! Oh! No. The pilot and the dog. Oh. Yeah. Now this is this is the one about the soldiers who fight in World War One. Oh yeah. Classic, Back yeah. then, you know, we called it the Great War. <laughs> it really was. Oh yeah, of course she had like an alternate life of being a nurse. Congratulations! Oh, wait, 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 wait! You can't start today. Today's the rehearsal dinner. Oh no, I'll be done by then. No, you will not. I'm off to fight the Nazis. <laughs> no, wait, Joey. We fought the Nazis in World War Two. Not World War One. Oh yeah, <laughs> didn't even. <it. laughs> One. <clears throat> Go ahead. Yeah, you take that one. Everyone knows the Nazis, and that's it. Who did we fight in World War One? Mexico. Yes, <laughs> very good. <laughs> Mexico. <laughs> Joey Tribbiani. This is Richard Crosby. He's playing Vincent. Uh, Gary Oldman. I'm doing my scenes with you. Yeah, nice to meet you, Joey. Is that Gary Oldman? You just won an Oscar. No, I didn't. <laughs> I think you did. <laughs> I literally thought it's Gary Oldman for two seconds. No, you know what? I'm not. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. It's Gary Oldman. Okay, yeah. I'm not. I'm not going to sit there debating if it is for five minutes. It's just Gary Oldman sorted. He didn't get a round of applause. What? The platoon is dead. Case facts, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we gonna do? We have no oh, reinforcements, no, no food. No, we still have food in the basement. I saw potatoes and some dried pasta. <laughs> He's doing that on purpose. You keep touching your face. Is something wrong? 
No. Just say he's spitting on you. I thought it might be kind of a cool character thing. You know, he's a he's a face toucher. Oh, th this is his career. We may not have any weapons, but we still have food. In the basement, I saw potatoes and some dry pasta. And a few tins of tuna. Why does he always get these shitty roles? <laughs> or shitty co-stars or shitty directors? Do you realize that at this time tomorrow, we're going to be getting married? Wait a minute, I have a date tomorrow night. <laughs> All right. I just, I, I can't believe that we made it. Well, you might die tonight. You haven't made it yet. <laughs> what? Oh, she thought you were well, going to back out. Honestly? She thought you were going to back ever out. Ever since we got engaged, I've been waiting for something to, to oh. flip you out. Ooh. He's been very level-headed the whole season. Yeah, you know, I keep thinking that something that. stupid is going to come up and I'll go the all... thing here and there, but they had one episode, I think, where they were both, like, quivering. No, that was just Monica. <laughs> About not being able to sleep with anyone else. Here we go. Your dad's died on the way here. Hey, if you're calling before Saturday, here we go. Richard. Monica and Richard. But if you're calling after Richard. Saturday, you reached Mr. and Mrs. Bing. Or is it just some wholesome moment? For the Bings! <laughs> ah. <laughs> ah, is, is that the moment? Is that the moment? Oh, he's freaking out. Okay. He's going to back out in here the last episode. At the last possible moment. Hi, oh, you guys look so beautiful. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Bing! Don't do it, Chandler! <laughs> Hey, just so you know, I had my uh, older brother talk with Chandler. Mm. What, well, bro? I told him that if he ever hurt you, I would hunt him down oh, and kick his ass. Oh, no. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, he says it with such confidence. Bro, my <laughs> bro you got it so pissed. Um, thanks for wearing. Something. <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's something. Well, you're lucky. At least the people that spit on you are famous. Uh, Who spits sure. on you? I don't want to talk about work. <laughs> Why was a job again? I, I, it's a masseuse, but we just never hear of it. It's lovely to meet you. So, are you his mother or his father? Chuck! That's okay. I've never seen one before. <laughs> no, Chuck! He's wrong. Why don't you go talk to him? Oh. I didn't even have a chance to act as though I'm okay with it. Uh, yeah, that's a facepalm moment. If I if I ever saw a facepalm moment, that is the one. Dad. <sighs> Hi, Mr. Bing. I think Monica's a bit of a fangirl, you know, of Chandler's dad. A little old to be wearing a dress like that. Don't you have a little too much penis to be wearing a dress oh. like that? Oh, I'm going to clean oh my, my glasses. God. Yeah. <laughs> you could kick anyone's ass you want to. You need validation from your Thank parents. You guys. How old is Ross? Well, he's 30, you know? He'll turn 30. Man in the black dress. Man in the You could have just pointed at him. Monica and Chandler's. I'm Amanda. Oh, I get it. No, yeah. Uh, man. Yeah. Duh. <laughs> yeah. Oh God, come on. That's such a shit joke, but so great. That's actually class. <laughs> I'm um. Uh, I'm Ross Geller. <laughs> Doctor Ross Geller. <laughs> Dad, please. <laughs> That's what I was saying. Um, <laughs> I'm Doctor Ross Geller. <laughs> <laughs> Bride is my little sister. And so far, so she's good. The greatest Ross? sister a guy could ask for. Yes, Ross. A wholesome moment where it's not being a fool. The couple, we're here to celebrate to the Bings. <laughs> to the Bings. Uh, we gotta, we gotta stop saying that for like 24 hours, I think. Yeah, and thanks for putting my grandmother in the cab and making sure she got to the hotel safely. Well, of course! That is what I'm here for! Okay, sorry. Oh. What grandmother? Yeah, I do. I know it. I know it. I know it. <laughs> You're Neo. Hey, what have you been? But are you going back to work? Yeah. Nice shades. Wait, what? Nice. I, thought was a yeah, I figure if I wear these in my scenes, oh, he's not at least I won't get spit in my eyes. <laughs> okay, don't worry. And that's if fine. I remember correctly, Ray Ban was the official sponsor of World War One. <laughs> no, he was kind of the same legit. No, I. <laughs> I'll see you later. Right. <laughs> Here we go. Chandler. He's crying. 
He's not ran. He's not Chandler? ran. He's not done it. He's not done it. Chandler, don't. No. What have you done? Don't ruin Chandler. Hey, is uh, is Monica here? She's steaming her dress. He's jumped in. He's not ran away. I think Chandler's gone. Chandler, I swear to God. Tell Monica I'm sorry. No, he hasn't. He hasn't done it. What's up? Tell Monica I'm sorry. Uh. Tell her yourself. Oh. <laughs> Chandler, you can't have thought it. Tell Monica I'm sorry. I drank the last of the milk. <laughs> writing to tell her that, that he's changed his name. Uh. You know, tell Monica I'm sorry. No, that doesn't work. I know you try to do that. Out and left. Don't be so negative. <laughs> oh, God, isn't it possible that sorry is sitting in there right now? Oh, we're going to call... Start calling Chandler, sorry. I'm gonna have to go find him and bring him back. Okay, but if you don't find him and bring him back, I am gonna hunt you down and mm. kick your ass. <laughs> I, will, I will find him. Yeah, I was gonna say, mate, you ain't, you ain't laughing that one off. When Phoebe means it, she means it. I found the picture. Oh. <laughs> That's a good way of doing it, actually. Could you, uh, could you level the script? I don't want to. Just tell him! I know you're this great actor and you... He's very Leon the Professional. He's great in that. Bitten all over me, man. <laughs> well, of course I am. And when you enunciate, you spit. <laughs> yeah, wow. but that's a time of Didn't know place. that. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, okay, check it out. Picture? What picture? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a good one. The best spit scene is Shiv from Succession. We'll, uh, we'll see you tomorrow at the wedding. I wasn't invited. <laughs> Who didn't invite Gunther, bro? Well, then we'll, we'll see you the day after tomorrow. <laughs> no, you better invite him. That's sad. Mom? Dad? Mom? What Dad? What are you guys doing here? Well, you kids talk about this place so much, we thought we'd see what the fuss is all about. <laughs> I certainly I see it. why the girls like coming here. Why? The sexy blonde behind the counter. Uh, <laughs> got the got a bit of appreciation. The list that the people were allowed to sleep. Yes, no, no, I know, I know what the list is. Come on, sit down, have a cup of joe. No. <laughs> it's a, the answer, if a different answer, oh, it makes me cry. And if you see Rita Marino, let her know I'm looking for her. <laughs> he loves it. You can tell he just loves playing the role. Is that Cyberman at the back? What a picture? <laughs> a picture of my wife. Personal property. <laughs> Why do you have a picture of Paulette on your pack? <laughs> every every word is beginning with P possible. We were lovers for two years. <laughs> God, wonderful. Oh, they were lovely. Yeah. Here's your call sheet for tomorrow. Oh, I'm, I'm not working tomorrow. You are now. No, he yeah. ain't. Oh, no, I can't. You gotta get me out of it. I have plans. Important plans! <laughs> <laughs> you know, it is not, it is surely. I can't believe Chandler's dead. I'm actually so pissed off. Unless there's something wholesome, like he's sorry. It, maybe there is a reason. There's gotta be something. I'm getting married today! Oh, wow. <laughs> I think you just cracked a rib. But I don't care, because today is my wedding day! My day is finally here! <laughs> You know, she might not even notice he's gone. Yeah, I found one. Okay. Why? Oh, thank you. you oh, why? God. Can I have another one? Pregnancy test in the bin. Sure. Pregnancy test in the bin. <laughs> pregnancy test in the bin. Pregnancy There's too too much focus on the bin. Oh, pregnancy the test. Bunch. Ah, Monica's pregnant. Oh my God. What? I knew it. There was a pregnancy test in the garbage. And it's positive. Who? Monica's pregnant. Uh... So I guess she won't be totally alone. <laughs> oh, Chandler. What's going on? Next time on Friends. No, stop. Yes.
next time on Friends. Patreon warned me, do not watch the next time on Friends. Uh, I feel like I wouldn't have anyway. Why the fuck would I want to watch it? Yeah, we'll do the next episode. Fuck it. Why, uh, uh, why do I tell myself that I'm... Why do I even be like, oh, I'll see how I feel. Fuck off, Joe, you twat. You're clearly going to watch the next part. You always end up doing it, so just tell yourself you'll do it. Um, oh, Chandler. I'm so disappointed in Chandler. Why? Why? You, you just... You had, you are the cliche, well you were, of not being able to stick to commitment, or not to be able to, to commit. That was the whole thing. And then Monica came along and broke the cycle, and now he's like, second, because he heard a voice machine call him the, calling them the bing, so it's like, hit him. I'm hoping there's like a silver lining, and maybe it's, I don't know, like, why else could he have ran away? I get like, Rachel and Phoebe were trying to come up with a reason, so I'm trying to do the same thing, but... Nothing's coming to mind. He'll show up. There's no way they just don't have the wedding now. You've had too much build up and it will ruin Chandler's character. So th there's no way. He's already on thin ice. <laughs> so we'll see. But uh, Jack was great. Some questionable dialogue coming out, out of his mouth that you wouldn't be getting today. That's for damn sure. But yeah, I, I, Jack's just great. Jack's great. Ross was. Ross was doing, trying to be Big Brother Ross, which was kind of cringe, but he was wholesome. He was wholesome. I liked Ross this episode. He was ridiculous because it was Ross being Ross, but uh, yeah, Joey and Gary Oldman was great as well. Uh, Rachel was wholesome. I like that. She's just kind of freaking out for Monica and Phoebe was great. Everyone was really good this episode and Monica's pregnant, so... Ooh. I wonder if Chandler saw that. No, I'd, I don't believe that Chandler would have seen the pregnancy test and just have ran away. I don't believe that for a second. No. I don't know. All right, we're going to do the next part. So I'll see you for episode 24, the finale, and Patreon, TikTok, all that stuff down below. I'm going to jump into the episode now. So, yeah, <laughs> see you then. Take care. Peace.